Hi guys, Rich here at the Collector Car Gallery. We're looking at this uh, 1967 427 435 horse uh, uh, Corvette Coupe. Um, this is a car that's finished in ermine, white, bright blue interior with a blue stinger. Just a killer looking car. I uh, really love the way this thing looks. Uh, this is a restoration that only has about 48 miles on it since the restoration. Um, we are representing this car um, for a very close friend. Uh, this particular one we are. Um, <clears throat> the restoration was finished, uh, I believe, within the last five years. This car has top flighted also, uh, and we'll be sure to get get everybody some pictures and video of that of that of those documents as well. Um, just like all of our videos, we're just going to kind of do a a basic condition, fit, finish, walk around of the car. Um, first impression uh, of the chrome driver's side bumper. Uh, this is in excellent condition. Excellent. I don't see one even surface scratch of any type on the car, or on the bumper, excuse me. As I'm looking at the nose of the car, uh, the headlight fit looks excellent. I don't see any road rash or anything. The fit of the hood looks very nice. That just looks killer with that blue stinger. I mean, God, that looks good. <clears throat> As we look down the side of the car, uh, I don't see any signs of any bad body work or anything like that. Uh, looks like we got rally wheels on this car. Um, when we do our underside video, we'll get a better look at like the bonding strips and things like that. Uh, looks like Coker Classic Red Lines on the car. And it's a little wax build up there or something. So again, a little wax wax right here build up. I'll, we'll take a picture of that after we get that off there, just so everybody can see it. As far as blemishes in the paint, I don't see anything. I'm trying to look real close here for everybody. Side pipes on this car, stainless around the windshield. Looks like it's in excellent condition. Engine compartment, you know, fit for the fit for the car show. I mean, look at this. I mean, look at some of these stuff. Look at these brake lines and look at this. I mean, look down there at that at the that valve at the bottom of the um, radiator. I mean, all this stuff. You know, tower clamps on everything. I mean, look at the fuel rail here. It looks great. All this stuff is is like like showroom, showroom looking, showroom finish. Got the, you know, kind of the sloppy goop going like all the Corvette guys want to see. Window felt looks great. Door forward fit of the door, rear fit of the door. Excellent. Nice. Door shuts nice. Let's take a look at the rear quarter here. Yeah, I mean this this car probably could use a a polish. It's been in storage for a bit. Um, I don't really I don't see anything, but I just think it would really pop again. If it uh, if it had just a little polish on it, uh, rear bumper, very good condition, very very good. Tail light bezels are like new. I do I do not believe we have a tank sticker for this for this car. Passenger side rear bumper, excellent condition. Laser straight paint job on this car, guys. I mean, everything about it, just very nice.
get a little hairline little hairline crack in the in the in the paint right there all this weather stripping looks like new seats are in excellent condition along with the carpet Looks like uh, look like original seat belts. So it looks like somebody located like originals to put them in. Obviously date coded, I'm sure. <clears throat> Excuse me. Good looking trim tag. Good looking vin tag. Dash is perfect. I mean. Headliner is exceptional. Yeah, this thing is like fresh, fresh. Let's go look at the driver's side. <clears throat> Looks like we got a couple little brooch marks up at the top there. You can see height is appropriate for the, the where it's at on the water pump. Characters look appropriate. Yeah. You know, it looks good. I think. Same place for that little crack. Kind of see that. Door panels are excellent. Wood steering wheels in perfect condition. 48 miles in this car since the restoration. I'm sorry, my light here. 48 miles in this car since the restoration. 435 tack, just like it's supposed to be. Transistorized radio. Transistorized ignition. Driver's seat, <clears throat> I mean, you know, it, nobody slid their butt across this thing. I mean, this all just looks like brand new. So, really nice piece. We'll get it on the lift so everybody can see the underside. Um, and then we'll go from there. We can try to fire this car real quick. I'm not sure how the battery is on the car, but... Uh, Put the battery on and temperature check here. You can see at the manifold right there, 58 degrees, you know. Same as in here, same as my foot ish. Okay, right on the water pump, 58 degrees. So, nothing more frustrating than going out to a car and it won't cold start. Actually, look at this though. I mean, look at this. Look at this stuff. Powder coated frame. I mean, this is just like new. Like the car is brand new. Never been driven. I mean, wow. Looks great. Okay, yeah, let's shut this guy. <clears throat> Looks like maybe our hood latch might be a little sticky. Let's see if we can't fire this thing up. Let's see if it wants to do it or not. <clears throat> Yeah, just a shave. Just needed to get a little fuel up top. It's been
been a while since this thing's ran, so that's how that transistorized ignition works though. You know, most guys sit there and just kind of turn this thing over and over, but it really doesn't start until you let off the key. So. Brake lights on. Clock's working. Tack's working. Nice piece. like our headlights uh, we'll have to make sure the headlights work for for somebody so we're gonna to wanna to check the headlights for um, anybody who, uh, who may be interested in this vehicle. Excuse me. Well, looks like the headlights were working, maybe just a little slow. So that's something that we can check for sure and make sure they are uh, performing on demand for uh, the next prospective owner. So once again, guys, Rich here at the Collector Car Gallery, looking at this brand spanking like new 427-435 coupe. Finished in ermine white with bright blue and a blue stinger. Thanks a lot.